you know, as long as the need is there yep. and you can partner with somebody, um, it doesn't matter what amount you have. One of the things I really don't like is when any of our accounts that I'm managing are not working. If there's any right. money in there, that's if, if, if I've got an account that's up to $8,000, $10,000, that's just, just doesn't sit well with me. So I'm looking for a place to put it. Um, but I've gone as low as one of our accounts going as low as uh, $7,000 and linking that up, partnering with three or other accounts to get that money working. So as long as your borrower doesn't mind cutting four checks uh, per month, it's a great way to build up your small dollar IRA. So you're, you're talking about linking up with other people's IRAs mm -hmm. um, and, and, you know, someone's needing a hundred thousand, but maybe you have, you know, you know, 8,000 in one, 30 in another, and mm -hmm. just kind of pairing them all together. Yeah. Um, go ahead. Bill. I was going to say real quick to, to kind of get around that, if the borrower doesn't want to write four checks, you can always hire a third party managed uh, um, servicing right. company, send all the money to them and they'll cut the checks for you. Yeah. Like you guys did. Yeah. Yeah. Well, to, to be fair, we're not really a third party uh, servicer. We can only service loans that we have a piece in. Mm -hmm. uh, we, we have to own a piece of the loan before we can yeah. service it. However, um, there are plenty of companies out there that, um, hire out. They have to be licensed. Some states require certain licenses, others not so much, but mm -hmm. there are companies out there that are, are specifically there for IRA folks. Yeah, so, right. Uh, and go it's, ahead. Good, it's good for um, when you're new at this to have a third party servicer or, or someone like Carolina Hard Money to take care of your loans. And then if something goes south, uh, you're not just left hanging trying to figure out how, what to do with this property. You've got someone that's experienced that can help you with that. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Cause when, when things, you know, and things do go wrong in real estate and, and notes all the time. So, you know, it's, you know, do they have that loss mitigation experience to help mm -hmm. you through a default, through a foreclosure, through a bankruptcy, yep. you know, what, what have you until you learn those things yourself. Yeah. Um, I know, let's see, someone says, so as little as 20 K would be okay to partner with someone as little as $1,000, as little as 500 would be okay to mm -hmm. partner with somebody. You, you know, as long as the need is there yep. and you can partner with somebody, um, it doesn't matter what amount you have.